All right. Well, Mondays appears to be the day for bad audio. <laughs> and also the day where I randomly um, talk about different things while working on a song. So maybe I should just call it uh, um, the anything. Day. No, Monday. Monday sounds better than the anything day. So we'll just go with that. So last time I was working on April, and uh, I decided to go ahead and, and change the MIDI into audio, just so it works better. So, okay. Let's see. It works better for stuff like fade outs and, and uh, fade ins, like you did right here. in here uh, in these instruments so it's interesting because how I got started on YouTube was doing audio stuff actually not video um, I started with uh, an audio drama based off of Pilgrim's Progress kind of the untold stories type thing well that's what it turned into uh, before I had to sort of cancel the project because I lost all my, my uh, voice actors. But anyway, that, that's one of the things I did to get started. And I think from there on, I just kind of changed into um, just creating things that I thought would help people because I was learning about sound and different things. and. And I thought, uh, you know, if I, I think it probably started with the trimmer uh, video, because I tried vlogging for a while, that didn't work so well. And then I had uh, a video on how to change the belt on the trimmer, because I went looking for information on that particular uh, trimmer as a power mate. Nobody really had any videos on that, so. So I thought, well, I'll make a video and I'll put it up, and uh, that way people who have a power mate trimmer can see how to fix it, and they did. Uh, so, um, you know, well, I tried unboxing videos before, but I, I wanted to do vlogging, and then I realized I don't quite have the personality for it, so. Uh, I kind of like this hard when you know text. Sounds a lot better than it does by itself, right? So I realized I, I can make videos, but um, let other people do. I don't occasionally do a vlog, but not like, uh, I wouldn't think it was one of those daily vloggers in the whole context and it's out there. So. So I just started doing unboxing reviews of stuff that I had, and not that no one else had done it, but it was my take on it, and just sharing my experience with the gear and the software. So, so this song kind of evolved from, uh, let's see, it was part, this is the second version I've done of it, I kind of have it reversed here. The original ones. Well, Great. Open a new project tab that would help. Mm, oh, here's one. This is probably where I left off last time, in fact. Yeah, that's to load all the big plugins. So that's one advantage to converting your, uh, your MIDI into audio. Um, there's 
couple different ways to do it, I'm sure. I, the way I did it is just to render out the um, solo track I wanted as audio and render it out. So I got, I mean, it does take a lot longer than <laughs> loading all your virtual instruments instead of just, uh, just three of them and audio. Come on now. Yeah, it's really, really good. Let's see if I can do I can't do anything else. And we're about to crash, I think. I hope not, but okay. Ah yes, here we are. So I took all this piano. You know, I actually got rid of my other instruments because I had this one. See how it sustains when it's MIDI, whereas when it's audio, and you go, stops right away. That's because this is like playing an actual piano instead of recording the piano, so. Something like that, anyway. What else did I have here? Oh, I think I had the... Uh... Um, that, I went over in my first video on uh, the blocks wired presets from the actor. That's just one that... Uh, oh, you disabled it. That's one that... Uh... <laughs> Get it right, Jay. Okay. So that that's one of those shows for that. Uh, okay. So I went to build on it and created another version, which is I've shown really simply we just do save new version. So kind of along the lines of rain, it starts like this. Go to something that's moving. And then I thought at some point we should bring in a harp. I'm playing some of the same notes as the piano. You know. So I'll expand to break for these. So I'll actually stripped out some of the notes from the piano. And then I found a nice pad. I had a washing sound over it. And then of course you have to have your bass sound. And, or I like to have a bass sound in it. This is a the Reaper stock synth. It just sounds like, you know, it's a sine wave, and you can do your own. It starts with a sine wave, and you add extra square triangles. I did some stuff there. I don't really remember exactly what, but there's a low rumble and a nice high sizzle. parts together. So yeah, what I what I did with the piano, I decided it's an acoustic piano and an analog piano, so here's the analog. And then uh, I want the acoustic piano in there as well, so put them both together. This idea of it raining or something, so that's why I added in the, the pad. You know, the sort of sort of wet sound, and then with the harp and everything, the strings.
back down to the two original instruments. Okay, so that was coming together nicely, and then I just suddenly got this random idea, which is why I made a third one of uh, doing some a few tricks. In a bit. In fact, I think I'm just going to go ahead and move these. I'm going to glue them. Well, that way you don't have all these moving parts. Just because I like playing with your birds, it's fun. I feel like it's missing something in there, though. I'm going to do this. So, I'm going to try this again because it didn't work earlier. X key. Let's see if I can get it to recognize. There it is. Okay, work with me. I feel like it, it, it should be something that, that kind of stands out. That sounds better than you know, let's see. Headed, so I'm just going to see what I can do with that. Okay, so I got like a, uh, what was that at the end there? to remind me to not keep this video too long, but uh, I'm going to just grab this real quick and run a timer.
Okay, yeah. <laughs> the first inspiration is the best. I should have been recording and it goes down from there. But anyway, uh, a little more on April and how I got started and just random things. Mondays. Okay, um, there's more coming later this week, so look out for those videos. Continuing on with the uh, sound design and musical layers should be good. All right. Uh, see you next time.